my dear students, today I am coming to you with a new poem. The name of the poem is Death the Leveler and it's written by James Surley. Before we go into the poem, let's know something about the poet. He was born in 18 September, 18 September 1596 in London, United Kingdom. And he died on 29 October 1666, that also in London, United Kingdom. He was educated at Merson Taylor's School, London, St. George College, Oxford, and St. Catherine's College, Cambridge, where he took his BA degree in or before 1618. In sok lisinga magacam nga mari putra taruki September gitara ni panda poki mahaksi. So lisinga chatro kumputaruki October kuma panda Lake Devon United Kingdom da Saint uh, Mercen Taylor's School da Mahitama ki London gi Saint George College Oxford da Amsung Saint Catherine's College Cambridge da Mahitama ki ada gama BA degree selection ki bani 1618 gitara. He was a very prolific writer and a highly regarded dramatist during the reign of King Charles I. King Charles I ko magi matam da England gi yamna maming chatpa yamna hekta la ma am iramba drama ma am iramba ai bani ma se writing 31 plays three masks and three moral allegories. Na si ekhuna ne ga dori ba sairing se. That the leveler have se makti mana sairing wen iramba da te. Ma se is hei wen iramba ni this well-known poem, Dead the Leveller, also known by its first line, as the glories of our blood and state, appear at the very end of James Surley's play entitled The Contention of Ajax and Ulysses for the Armour of Achilles, which was printed in the year 1659. Man iram ba play ma? Mami yam sir ba play ni? The contention of Isaac and Ulysses na thon ba kogi play dogi last part yao wani sige si. Masigi sayring sige ay ko background dogi wari dunakoy tayo pa. Tungdi dogi na kuya na tapa da sayring sige na pa da na wai na bukid na mukto. Masigi si kogi Greek ki kogi Trojan War hay tayo na ko. Greek ki yam na mami sir ba Homer ki Iliad hay ba? Ay kogi Greek ki, kau ini kenal ke Helen of Troy ki, wari itu, dari Yahuba, yang mana apa Yahuba Greek ki soldier ama, apa Yahuba Greek ki, kau ini Achilles ni hero ni Yahuba kau, mana lagi tu, macam tu dah, Achilles ki mana sinar ramba armor se, mana sinar ramba mana se, ramba cara ramba masa ngak tuh naba, macam armor se, kena apa pengaruh kita ke, sekitar macam tu, kena cegat naba macam Greek ki kem tu, tu Yahuba kau, ada itu, macam tu kita macam ingat apa, atau apa Pau buat nampak ani kak, Azak saya bangga, Yulisa saya bangga, ani sih kat darak bayi tar. Karena apa dia mui ni mukti karena dia mui mui gigi servis ni kat darak pak, aje master na pau beli, aje master na pau beli, nampu izin malaiya nak matam sida. Matam tu tu leh ramai kerja general, ramai officer, ramai cang eh, aduk a debate tau nhal eh. Azak sendiri Yulisa, ani maksa wangang na hali, mai mana kerja kita wangang bana. Last tak, aku gigi Azak na ngang belor ramai matam dia Yulisa, dia ngang matam sida. Yulisa ski speech na, he na convincing, oibah he na eloquent, oibah Adu ayat itu kita di, aku lagi, saya amsi dengan waris anda ramai tu nda. Pilih pun mula orang, the armor of Ulysses must go to, the armor of Achilles must go to Ulysses na panggada bani hati na hairak bani. Ayam utang ingat ada hari korang nak kau dekat. The play is set in the Grecian camp outside the walls of Troy during the Trojan War. It opens soon after the death of Achilles with the servants of Ajax and Ulysses disputing the relative worth of their masters. The servants dispute quickly turns into an argument and then a fight. Then Greek generals and officers enter and sit themselves to hear the debate. Ajax and Ulysses also join them and make their claims. Ajax begins, he speaks first, makes a long and a fulsome speech in praise of his own valor and the prowess in battle, Lampam dah magi vela and the prowess, magi strength and the magi, hey simba maya magi matahun ada thagat cerga masuk angzai ibu. 
and he also attacks the courage and the character of his opponent Ulysses. Then Ulysses speaks second and he is far more eloquent and convincing. His speech is far more and more eloquent and convincing. Now when the contenders withdraw, the generals decide to award Achilles armor to Ulysses. Achilles ke armor is Ulysses to Peter Zena, my warita wariapta abaneva. Aduda Azax lost his mind as a result of his defeat to Ulysses. Mada yet never the magi debate to the Ulysses came upon the mighty give the Azax a wakal chirak by Tare. Masi eventually commit suicide. Wakal to my mother than a depression, Narga wakal chirak and the Mase suicide commit to give, suicide to see give. Aduda Azax nas hebe with them to the magi. The brief final scene of the story of the play shows Azax's funeral, Magi funeral Utpaniva. And that this poem was a dirge at the funeral of Azax. Azax later bagi, Magi Ekogi, Magi later bagi, Torum Pangto, but the Sakpa Isai Nebago. At the Sigi Smina, Sigi background is a Kangabugitung, the Equinus Herings, the Hining is a Kerino, who Sigi poems, the Nanza, Yam the Universal Tim Nikos, the Hydeza, Sigi Herings. This poem deals with the recurrent theme of the futility of human vanity and the pride which are rendered ineffectual at the end, with death looming large over us. Mr. Hydeza, you know, Bunganza, Equigi, Equin Hinging with them, the Aedis Hagay at the Pokpony. Aigi pai pu de adu oirami. Ai na si to wonga mami si to wonga mami hai dena pung na riba mayam zha. Asa loi rakpa da si ba matam da di kari su khe na balai te. Waang na sagai zaat pha na poko ma su. Lai na poko ma su. Ina khun ma su. Lai raba ma su. Sakti le ba ma su. Adu ka minai wari ba ma su. Adu ka dharma adu chat pa mi su. Adu chat pa mi su. Loi rakpa da di kari ima ta khe na balai te. Koi zha si ba gyo pham na chaap ma nai hai ba dunia ko. Sai reng zha hai ning zha. Adu ka loi rakpa da ampa zha ba mese zha mana loi shali sai reng zha. The poem leaves. The poem ends on an optimistic note that the actions of the just survive the sting of death. Noble loiba apa ba thabak taro magambu sing dudi asi bagi kaya tagi asi ba na makoi ba mai thi bibangam de makoi de koi ni hingra le hawi hai bdeni. Sige sereng sige koi na three stanzas yawi sereng sige pereng sige dako sereng sige three stanzas legani stanza ma onda line nipan nipan legani aduga line sing dugi rhyming pattern hai tare. Rhyming pattern hai kadangang sa akwe na khanga da bazi sa ideenga magi parengi last sound do adu gi arrangement na makak nikau adu na sige sa ideenga sige rhyming pattern zi na kamai lege bu A, B, A, B, C, C and D, D yada lege nikau Now sa ideenga si paas akwe huse akwe na sa ideenga si parakaan zi da no na huse hai ke ba ayin na A, B, A, B adu ga C, D, C, D C, C, D, D na hai bagi moong do ay first ki stenja zi paarak na kwe da taak yong ko sa The glories of our birth and state so the other states are line of color, fates are similar sound to the other states. The other states are A, and the other things are the second line of the other things are B, and the state is the fate, and the things are the kings. So it's A, B, A, B. The other one is the crown, the down, the one that is the C, C. The other one is the spade, the other one is the spade. Jadi nak loi berni, mana apa sahun loi berni, asalnya mudi di kau betul. So A B A B C C D D. Ini bah, mungkin sudah rhyming pattern sudah sering sikit stanza. Aku kira, hukum maksud ikan ni, aduh ke stanza mana anda line nipan nipan yang aku ni. Okay, aku sering sikit nak kau tahu nang tung pagi tak sih kau ngasa. Yang sih kau. The glories of our birth and state are shadows, not substantial things. There is no armor against faith. Death lays his icy hands on kings. Scepter and the crown must tumble down and in the dust be equal met with the poor crooked side and the spade. Some men with swords reap the field and plant fresh laurels where they killed. But their strong nerves at last must yield. They tame but one another still. Early or late, they stoop to faith. And must give off their murmuring breath when they pale captives grief to death. The garlands wither on your brow, then boast no more your mighty deeds. Upon that purple altar now see where the victor victim bleeds. All heads must come to the cold tomb. Only the accents of the just smell sweet and the blossom in the dust. This is the poem. Now let's analyze, let's study the poem. 
line by line and a stanza by stanza. I am going to ask you a question. Ahan bagi stanza ni kan hari. The glories of our blood and the state are shadows, not substantial things. There is no armor against faith. Death lay its icy hands on kings. Safety and the crown must tumble down and in the dust be met equal with the poor crooked sight and the spade. Mepham zidi yaw riba blood and the state hai se. Blood and the state blood refers to our high birth and the state refers to social rank. So those means unreal things. Armor means defense or actually armor is the metal covering metal coverings formerly worn to protect the body in the battle icy hands refer to the cold hand of death that makes everything cold safter is an ornamental staff carried by rulers as a symbol of their authority tumble down tumble down means collapse the crooked side crooked means curved Side is a blade for cutting grains or grass. Here, crooked side and the spade, they are symbols of a peasant. Now, here in the stanza, James Surly says that that does not care about whether an individual comes from an aristocratic family, royal family, and one's position, status, and achievements. These are temporary things and are insignificant. No one can escape from the hands of, from the clutches of death. No one can escape from faith. The armor which protects a king or a soldier from an attack becomes powerless in the hands of faith. That tax bought the lives of kings and the farmers. That does not discriminate anyone on any criteria. Everyone will die and become dust one day. Go. The glories of our blood and the the glories of our blood and the state are shadows. Aquina, I disagree with the Pokpani. High birth, blue birth, blue blood, I did royal blood, the Pokpani. I did social rank, Wang Bugini, no in Handabat Hakini. High than Aquina, I disagreezat of Havani, Pipe, Wang Chauvani, Pipe, Sakti Labani, Aquina Pungze, Riba Mamze. They are all shadows, they are all unreal things. Makuiza Karisuli, Tabakasu Kana, the reports in Labour. They are not substantial things. There is no armor against faith. A she begin my octangal talk number. Kadigumba Pambay Amatalite. Defensive mechanism Amatalite. A she begin out to no Pambay Amatalite. And as an insane by Aquina. Petri be quietly powered about the greatest conqueror of all times, Alexander the Great. Masagi say, contrary to his who will seek. Petri be the magi the Mokta de Pigmali. This world is not enough for me. I don't know. Greek taken in India about what? Oh, what about vast empire, my largest empire in the world, created thoroughly by Alexander the Great, Masusiki. There is no armor against faith. Death lays his icy hands on kings. Ashi bagi ing laba kutto, maduna ning thousingi ma kutta su, batakta su thamlai. Ashi bagi ing laba kutta, hai de kenu. Ashi bagi makta da si rabu matam, when we die, our body becomes cold, everything becomes cold. So death lays his icy hands on kings. Death even claims the life of kings. Ashiva hai basina ningtao singu zu hat pangam ebe. The scepter. Scepter hai zi ningtao zi na maagi power taak na na bagi da makta ningtao zi ngi makuta paiba. Noi na film da kai da ugani ningtao zi makuta yet thang ma makuta chai ma paai gani. That scepter kawai kadu gita. That rod to. Erigi chai to that stick to. That stick, that rod symbolizes his power and authority. My authority ta ini ebe kangbra. Adu gyo fam zi da scepter and the crown must tumble down hai zi. Scepter and the crown zi na pula pula kanda ning thao bu nebe ta ezi. Ning thao do adu su si ga nebe. He will tumble down. Magi power, magi crown, magi rod, they will all collapse. Moi su pheelo ega nebe kangbra. Moi si ga ni. They will tumble down and in the dust be made equal. Moi ju chaap maana ga ni. Kari ga maana ni. With the poor crooked side and spade. Sight and the spade, tangol amasung yopak pai riba lai riba lau misung dega luhup up liba adega makuta sakti gicai pai riba ning tahu dega makoi loi namak cak mana gani asih bagi mafam dah heba. So here in this stanza, the poet associates kings with scepter and a crown and the farmers or the poor peasants with sight and spade. So here he says, all our boast, all our glories, all our achievements. 
all our ego about our blood, our high blood and our social status, they are all nothing. They are all say the way things. They are not substantial things. There is no defense against faith. Death can conquer even kings, get great kings. The kings and the peasants will die in the same way. And when that comes, they are at the same level. Level And in the second stanza, the poet says, Some men with swords reap the field, and the plant fresh laurels where they kill. But their strong nerves at last must yield. They tame but one another. Early or late, early or late, they stoop to fate, and must give up their murmuring breath when they pale captives grieve to death. My friends, the highest in the kingdom, but I think, yeah, I'm not a power of missing though. Lantam kuting joy to wonga missing though. Ma koi zu loirek pude de dum si ba. Highest in biyone. Some men with their swords rid the field. Some people, some great generals, may achieve many things. For instance, a great and a mighty soldier, the generals, may conquer battles. They conquer the battlefield with their swords. Thang pairega with their swords. Thang the pairega mo na lan pam joy tawe ba. Kana gum ba lomi si na lau khau budo adu mai na. Thang pairega lau khau ba. Thang gol pairega lau khau ba adu mai na. In the same way, some men with swords. Kana gum ba mikar na makut tu da thang sang pai dina reap the field. They may win battles. Lan pam do joy tawe ayi ba. And the plant fresh laurels where they kill. Adu ga makoi na hardly ba mapam do da makoi ki minchat wrong kin ba ayi ba. They may plant fresh laurels. They may gain new honor and glory. Laurels have been seen, but the mama ki my park laba ay kung missing da ning tao na manaw na pibo pambising dun yaba ko. Adu ki manasing dun yaba. So here the poet says that some mighty people, some great, some valiant people, some soldiers, some generals, they may conquer battles with their swords. And they may erect trophies of victory over the newly conquered lands. But their strong nerves at last must yield. They are strong nerves. Powerful strength. Their strength, their strength will also collapse. They will also surrender to death. They tame but one another still. Human beings, the great conquerors, can conquer only human beings, but they cannot conquer death. Ashiba bu joy to wedding amde makoi na. Ashiba bu maithi bu pibu wedding amde. Me na maithi bu pibu ngam me miyo ibu kaktebu. Early or late, they stoop to fate. Stoop means bow down, means surrender. They may die young, they may die in all age. Sooner or later, they will also surrender. They will also die. Mojo si ka neighbor. Even the most powerful people. They will die sooner or later. And ultimately, what do they become? They must give up their murmuring breath. Mwagi slow, last moment ki breath to. Adu tap na tap na hola manang sa so do. Lep ki doi ni moizu. Kada mo matamda, when they pale captives creep to death. Miyo yabina si bi matamda di. Human beings become just pale, helpless prisoners. Paraga tham liba. Kadi siya tobang amdara ba bandi sing do. Adu na... Kadua kita nak tak makoi bu ngam laba makoi bu mai ti bu piri ba angam bising tu kita nak tak upai leh jadi nasi angsa ba adu mai na matam mama powerum ba general sing dusu lan mi sing dusu ning tau sing dusu asih bagi kita nak tak cepeng matam tadi makoi zu upai leh jadi raba mai ti raba bandi ya magum padok magum makoi zu satu ini upai leh tena adu ke si tu ini makoi zu sorang belap tu ini makoi zu so some men with swords they may reap the field with their swords. And they plant fresh laurels where they kill, but their strong nerves at last must yield. They but tame one another still. Sooner or later, early or late, they will stoop to death. Lan pam kaya joy toro mama koi su. Mi ma yama mahalga minchat urong killam ba makoi su. Pangan kalla ba makoi su. Makoi su no madi makoi ki pangal me yang tarakani aroi ba dasi ba dzangza gani makoi su. Makoi na hard pangami they can they tame. But one another still. Strong men can defeat another strong man, but they cannot conquer or defeat death. Sooner or later, they will surrender to death. 
and ultimately they become powerless, helpless, like the poor prisoners when the time of their death comes. Asi bagi matam laku matam nama koi loi nama upai letra bandi magum legani. Now let's go to the third stanza. Third stanza na kari mahari. The garlands wither on your brow. Then boast no more of your mighty deeds. Upon death's purple altar, now see where the victor victim bleeds. All heads must come to the cold tomb. Only the accents of the just sweet smell, smell sweet and the blossom in the dust. In the third stanza, the poet tells us that the mighty deeds, the achievements and the rewards which a man got in his entire life will disappear when, when once he dies. Death does not pay any attention to these things. Even a great victorious man becomes a victim when he faces death. He cannot defeat death. In the end, everybody will go to the grave and turn to dust. According to the poet, what remains is one's noble actions. People will remember a person for his actions, not even if he is buried in the cold tomb. So his actions will give him immortal fame. The garlands wither on your brow. Nang na mai pak le hai du na mai pak pake symbol na nang gi kok ta si ramba phaza ba lai pareng do na kok mak ta da adum u na u na adum kui da rakani. Means nang gi phaza ba mingja tam tam sumang za lakani ba nang gi mai pa ama nang gi pangal nang gi sakti nang gi achievement zing do loi na wak maang ki ga ne ba. Maang ba nai ba pot sing ne ba koi nang si ayi kaar duk lai regi yu ma duk lai regi lantu ma duk lai regi sakti ya sukam lai re na tauri puna mak se Puna maksiga roi ba malai ba ngangsa. Adu adi poet nari, then boss no more, your mighty deeds. Adu di nang ayi suk na mami, suk na mami hadina. Si ta wang na mami, si ta wang na mami hadina. Chau to kono na pal kagano. Man na fam sa hai ze, ngasai grik ke hero azaks tu na shibu matam do. Matam amal lan pham kaya joy to ramba, yek na ba kaya maithi ba piramba. Adu gumba azaks to ngasi hozik si rega lehre yengu tau isengu. Upon that purple altar, now yengu ashi bagi pham bak taksida. Where si, where the victor victim bleeds, yengu. Yang mai pak lembah mata mama pun kena pu mai tiba tiba ngomong benda apa doh ngasih di masa mak bikti mui na asli tarik leh dia yang garland saya nak masa mama jadi present tu je the reeds of victory or glories aku lagi mai pak pergi leh ting aku nak sejarah lembah aku lagi mai pak pergi simbol mai am doh will wither away they will disappear boy kui terak ni they will fade away on your brow from your forehead nangi leh bakti nangi kok ta Uplamba, nangi kok tu uplamba, mai pak pagi masak way deh ba, adu gum laba kudam cangdam sing do, lay pering do, kui terak ni. Then adu na boast no more of your mighty deeds. Aisyi tau bunga mi, aisyi tau bunga mi, adu na napal tau guno. Upon that purple altar, altar he si lay kurmna ba, nanti kita sacrifice tau nana ba lay deh, potcai kena nana ba duk thamai thana nana ba, kui gi ayam dekat tongkat mupam dunia beko. Aisyi bagi nganglay nana ba, nganglay nana ba macu gi altar matak tu. Bapa mesti ajar lan paham sing dah asmi am si doini asih begini macam ini begini macam tu si kau gigi ngang doini aduh si mata tak si gigi purple si mungkin so nak ni European culture sing tadi kau gigi si bega dead process ni kembali lagi nampak purple macam tu si ni aduh nama mana hari yang o asih begini asih begini lay thang mai thang paham si dah asih begini kau gigi puja kat paham si dah si yang o where the victor victim bleeds mata mama napal caw ramba Mipu mi ikut dia kumai tiba tiba ngam ambak ngasi na asih bahala lagi tu gigi makut tak tara bah victim oida masa yang ngupam sistem masuk si dulu leh si the victor victim is also lying dead there. Adun apa yang cerita hari all heads must come to the cold tomb, pau gera, ngau gera, ina kun gera, the king and the pauper alike, the rich and the poor alike, the high and the low alike, loi nama they will come, tekat lembah mengak to. Asyik bagi ing leba mungpam gigi pura itu dah lakani. Mipun kudi mak asyik bagi mungpam di sengsara itu boleh re. Nong asoi itu nasi gini. Aduna, napal cawu gono. Aisyi tau bunga mesi tau bunga mesi aduna. Sakti leba, pesa paya, ina kunba, nak koy muk gono. Lehau gudu budi kino. Only the accents of the just. Acum betoromba, apa betoromba. Cing lemba, apa betabak toromba, tabak sing do. Adu kata ni sweet. Smell, anam nungsi nelayan udah je, and the blossom lecat tamu udah je, and the dust. Kudi makna masha dua, aisyi tau bunga mami hai bandu pa dua makna upul loi na one kerbau matam da lecat udah di mana tau ramat tabak tu kita makta ni miam nasona udah je. Mana fazana tau ramai, so na organi fazana fazada bata bak tau ramai ti nengang na organi. 
So the poet says that when the powerful soldier has died, when all the rich and the powerful has died, people will remember a person for the actions. Even if he is buried in the cold tomb, his good, noble, and the just actions will give him immortal fame. Maana Omar o ina mingchat pangna leh udisi. Maa taromba phaba thabak tu gi matungi na ne. Aduna hingengi matamda apaba thabak tau na bohne si. Hai basi na sayring segi keno niko pang kogi pausel niko ngasa. Bapam zida koi na kogi meeting zina asib gi keno dachat matamdo. Asib gi pamba thak tu dachat matamdo. Si kari ke sang damna bay maana poet nung si bi mezung kog sinari. Here in the poem is the poem ends. We get an immeasurable lame who is taken to to an altar to be sacrificed to please the gods. Lai sing buhara ho nabagi damu ta pelan nabagi damu ta bali kat na nabagi damu ta puri wa hame nga maga ekwe miyue baga sang dam nari kaum. Apao ba mi sing duga. Makwe zu this kind of ritual was usually practiced in the primitive times. Thay na maangane taro mani lai sing pelan nabagi damu ta ji ba zing hat pa ze. Adu the sacrifice the lame does not know that it will die soon. Masana di sizare ni kang zadeba. So miyue ba zadugu mani ba. Akwe zu nong ma hao ziki sacrifice the lame da akwe kenodar altar da da akwe zu chattoy ni yaudoy ni. So loo shalak pa da ngang za akwe sayreng sin na ina graba ni na ko. Sayreng sin na kari hai ning hai bada amuk tanga yi kitang simple language da ino yi da hai rongge. The poem has a universal appeal. As the title of the poem suggests that is a great leveler. See, universal appeal to the people who are saying that they are not going to be able to do it, they are not going to be able to do it, they are not going to be able to do it, they are not going to be able to do it. They are not going to be able to do it. Man, Hayri is a great leveler. They are not going to be able to do it, but they are not going to be able to do it. They are not going to be able to do it. The high and the low, the rich and the poor, the strong and the weak are all equal before death. Death levels them without any discrimination. All our material achievements will disappear with this perishable body. Only our good and the noble and the just actions will remain immortal. Loi na mang gito niya ko na taro mo ko di magse leho gudo ni sa ay ko gip hazaba hazaba mingchat ay ko na taro mo pa bata bago tugi miyam na sona huwa nung siya hazaba mingchat to adu ko tni leho gudo ba adu ko na talamba lantum sanalo pa hazaba mingchat ay ko na taro mo ko di magse ishaga ko na na ishaga siya matanda pula mang gito niya ba apa bata bago tugi miyam na sona dun leho gudo ni so apa bata bago tugi siya ba adu ko ay ishaga yedo dapok pani ay ipa na adu ni ay gima na adu ni ay di adu gima sa masuni ay di adu gip thak tu leho gudo ni ay dun na napal tawo siya mukna ro siya adu ka na dapong atni puna mag to ari mani ay besni sa ring na hayris ako I think you enjoy the poem. Thank you very much.